Wang Yibo challenges his limits in the documentary Exploring New Lands. Today, the Discovery Channel released the trailer for its highly anticipated documentary, Exploring New Lands, starring Wang Yibo. Known as a talented idol and actor, Wang Yibo is now stepping into a completely new role, that of an explorer. In this documentary, he partners with some of China's top survival experts to tackle some of the world's most extreme environments. The documentary promises an exhilarating journey as Wang Yibo and the team embark on an adventure that pushes the limits of endurance and courage. From braving the scorching heat of the desert to diving deep beneath the ocean's surface to photograph glowing corals, and trekking through dense rainforests in search of rare wildlife, Wang Yibo is set to face some of the toughest challenges of his life. This isn't just a show about adventure, it's about testing personal boundaries and discovering the unknown. Fans and viewers are eager to see Wang Yibo in a different light, far from the glamorous life of an idol. The trailer hints at intense, pulse-pounding moments as Wang Yibo navigates the harsh realities of nature. Can he withstand the physical and mental demands of these dangerous terrains? Will he manage to find rare animals hidden deep within the rainforest or capture the beauty of bioluminescent corals while diving? The documentary seems to promise not only breathtaking scenery but also a story of resilience and growth. What makes this project even more intriguing is how Wang Yibo transforms from an idol into a real-life adventurer. Known for his fearless attitude and determination, Wang Yibo appears to embrace these daunting tasks with enthusiasm and grit. Fans are excited to witness a side of him that has never been shown before, making exploring new lands a must-watch for his followers and nature enthusiasts alike. As we await the full release, one thing is certain, exploring new lands is set to challenge Wang Yibo in ways he has never experienced before. This is not just a journey through uncharted territories but also a personal quest to push beyond his limits. Will Wang Yibo succeed in this new adventure? The world is watching. Reflecting on the phenomenon of the journey of Flower and its impact on fantasy dramas. Nine years ago, The Journey of Flower, starring Zhao Liang and Wallace Huo, took the fantasy drama genre by storm. This series, based on the novel by Fresh Guago, was more than just a television show, it was a cultural phenomenon that reshaped the landscape of Chinese television and catapulted its stars to newfound levels of fame. The journey of Flower not only cemented Zha Liang as a household name, earning her the title of TV queen, but also solidified the fantasy genre as a staple in Chinese entertainment. Now, as we see fresh Guaguo's works continue to be adapted, such as Ten Thousands Mad Flowers Come in Dreams, it is clear that the legacy of the journey of flowers still resonates deeply within the industry. The rise of Zhao Liang and Wallace H. Huo. Zhao Liang's portrayal of Hu Kiangu in the journey of flower was a defining moment in her career. Her performance as a young woman navigating a world filled with magical beings, forbidden love, and dark secrets was both nuanced and powerful. This role not only showcased her acting chops but also her ability to draw viewers into her character's emotional journey. The success of the show and her performance led to Zhao being crowned as the TV queen, an accolade that acknowledged her talent and the impact of her portrayal on audiences. Wallace H. Huo, her co-star, also saw significant boost in his career, with his portrayal of the enigmatic and stoic by Zahu earning him critical acclaim and a loyal fan base. Together, their on-screen chemistry was electric, a blend of tenderness and tension that left viewers captivated week after week. The creative vision of Fresh Guaguo. Fresh Guaguo, the author behind The Journey of Flower, became a celebrated name following the success of the series. Her storytelling, characterized by a blend of ancient mythology and modern fantasy elements, appealed to a wide audience, resonating particularly well on platforms like Jinji and Literature City. Her ability to create compelling worlds and emotionally complex characters has been a key factor in her popularity. With other successful works like Ten Thousand Mad Flowers Come in Dreams, Fresh Guaguro continues to be a driving force in the genre, proving that her narratives have staying power and broad appeal. 
10,000 mad flowers come in dreams, a new era of fantasy drama. As we look forward to the adaptation of 10,000 mad flowers come in dreams, the anticipation is palpable. This new series, which blends ancient tales with fantasy elements, promises to be as enchanting as the journey of flower. It features standalone stories set in mysterious worlds, each with its own unique charm and intrigue. The cast, led by Lee Hagai and Sun Zhenning, brings a fresh energy to the genre. Sun Zhenning, who first captured audiences' attention as Ye Mao in The Journey of Flower, has evolved significantly as an actress. Her transformation from idol to a respected actress has been remarkable, and her growing popularity is a testament to her versatility and talent. Sun Zhenning and Lee Hagai, Chemistry and Charm Sun Zhenning's recent involvement in 10,000 Mad Flowers Come In Dreams has generated considerable excitement. Known for her vibrant energy and captivating screen presence, her character in this new drama appears to be both lively and enchanting. Recent photos from the set show her in a vibrant red costume, which beautifully captures her character's spirited nature. Her transition into ethereal white attire further emphasizes the mystical elements of her role, enhanced by delicate accessories that add depth to her portrayal. Opposite Sun Zhenning is Li Hongai, who plays Ki Feng Yin, a character described as dark yet magnetic. Li Hongai's ability to bring a complex character to life, combined with his striking costumes and enigmatic persona, promises to add a rich layer of depth to the series. The previews suggest a compelling on-screen chemistry between Li Hongai and Sun Zhenning, one that echoes the intense and emotional narratives that made the journey of Flower so memorable. This pairing, along with the series' thematic focus on love and mystery, is likely to draw comparisons to classic romantic tales. The Evolution of Fantasy Dramas The continued adaptation of Fresh Guaguo's work signals a broader trend within Chinese television, the sustained popularity and evolution of the fantasy drama genre. These stories offer an escape into worlds where magic and reality intertwine, providing viewers with a sense of wonder and nostalgia. The genre's ability to adapt and evolve with new narratives and fresh faces keeps it relevant and engaging. 10,000 Mad Flowers Come In Dreams is poised to be the next big hit, drawing on the success of its predecessors while offering something new and exciting for fans. A legacy that endures. Reflecting on the impact of the journey of Flower, it's clear that the series did more than just entertain, it set a new standard for fantasy dramas in China. Its success paved the way for other works in the genre, demonstrating that there is a strong audience appetite for stories that blend fantasy, romance, and drama. As we await the release of 10,000 Mad Flowers Come In Dreams, there is a sense of anticipation and excitement, not just for what the series will bring, but for the ongoing evolution of the fantasy genre. The legacy of The Journey of Flower lives on, inspiring a new generation of stories and performances that continue to captivate and enchant audiences worldwide.